Hey YouTube, Jake Kilroy here, back at the shop. Um, welcome to an area of a shop you don't see very often. This is the north end of the building. And uh, you see I have pallet racks up here, my air compressor, I'm in the process of emptying this all out, moving this all out for renovations. So, pardon the dust, pardon the construction, but we got a little shop project I think you'll find interesting. So, what we have here is my Hypertherm Powermax 1000 plasma cutter. Um, it's an older unit and it's seen a lot of use and the torch is rather beat up and uh, Hypertherm in their wisdom sells a retrofit kit to retrofit the more contemporary Duramax torch and its consumables which are uh, uh, purported to last longer, be less expensive, that kind of thing. Uh, they have a retrofit kit to retrofit a Duramax torch to a Powermax power unit. So um, we're going to do that today. We got a box right down here with a uh, Duramax retrofit torch for this unit, and we're going to go through the process and document the process of how to do this. Um, if you have one of these older hypertherm units, probably works because these things, you know, they work. Uh, this is probably a good upgrade. I, you know, don't know how long or if forever you will be able to buy consumables for the older type of torch. So anyway, my torch was messed up, trigger was messed up from being used and abused and dropped and walked on and whatever. So it, it was needing a replacement anyway. So. Um, first thing we're going to do, we're going to unbox the retrofit torch, then we're going to remove the old torch, put the new torch on, then we're going to test it, make sure it works. So anyway, let's get with it. So here is the retrofit torch kit. This came from weldingstore.com. Never fear, I paid full retail for this bad boy. I have no affiliation with weldingstore.com. Um, I can say that um, they had uh, one of the best prices online and um, this arrived quickly, well packed and in good shape. It was in a, another box. This box was in an, an exterior box, so anyway. Part number that I ordered is part number 228789, so hypertherm part number. This is the 50 foot torch, 15.2 meters, um, with the angled head. So I believe they say it's like 75 degrees. They offer a angled head for handheld, they offer a straight handheld, and they offer a machine torch. This is the angled 50 foot torch. So here you go, here's the receipt. Just so you know, I paid $661.99 for a this retrofit kit and a consumables kit to fit this torch. Obviously all the old consumables I have, that I still have, aren't gonna work with this torch. Uh, they included a Nice sticker, I guess that's the welding store. Yeah, weldingstore.com sticker. Um, the torch itself comes with um, some consumables. Uh, we got a um, little marking material. Uh, here's a little sticker to replace. There's a sticker on top of the unit uh, that shows you how to put the consumables on the old torch. This will replace that sticker, which is good because it's beat to hell anyway, and show you how to put the consumables on the new torch. Um, oh, check it out. Product safety information and instructions. Now, instead of printing it, it comes on a 
USB stick. Handy. So nice. Put that in my pocket. Look, they, they even show you a little picture. Stick this in your computer in 14 languages. Uh, here's the little consumable kit that they included. Uh, nozzles, uh, shield, electrode. So they at least set you up with one uh, setup here. So let's compare, compare and contrast the old and the new. So this is the original torch, the T60. It came with this unit. Um, looks, you know, pretty similar. I mean, in size, this is definitely lighter. Um, this does appear to have a little more mass to it. Um, the safety trigger works pretty much the same way. Uh, so anyway, it's very similar. Um, I did, so looking at the old, the new consumables versus the old consumables, this is the new electrode. See it has this additional spring, this little metal insert here. This is the electrode from the old torch. Looks pretty much identical except for this additional unit here. Um, so there we go. Let's see what else we got here. Marketing mumbo jumbo. Um, here's the consumables kit that they sell for this torch. And more marketing mumbo jumbo. Uh, I mean, that's a nice little setup there. So you got electrodes, shields, all the parts you need to get running a little inventory sheet down here, nozzles, shield, deflectors, retaining cap, swirl ring, all that. There we go. over we're gonna take the business in this is a retrofit so this plug fits my supposed to fit my existing power unit this plugs in to the air connection so we're going to take this around reposition the camera and go ahead and hook this up um, in the box so here you go uh, there's the plug And let's compare. Yep, looks like the same plug. Except for this one pin right here, but no big deal there. And then we have the gas connection. Make sure your air is disconnected from your unit. And there we go. So, looks like pretty much an exact copy. Let's take the old one here, move it out of the way. Snap that connector through. And you have to twist this. Twist this connector around it only goes in one way there's an arrow over here that points up you have to pull that up there we go the air connection is done and make sure we got that oriented properly so that's that love hypertherm products Top quality, no mumbo jumbo.
Okay. We're going to replace that sticker with the new sticker. Tell you what, I wish my channel stickers were this well made. And again, I probably wouldn't want to know what the cost either. Out. Here we go. clamped a little straight edge on here to get a nice cut so I can show you the cut quality there I was cutting a little slow I think just a second there you go that's not bad quarter inch blows right on through there there you go easy swap works great you know hypertherm plasma torches are a fantastic product I'm not affiliated with them I'm not being paid to say that but I think it's pretty clear that uh, they are at the high end of the market uh, fantastic product well worth the investment the new torch is going to be nice. That 50 foot length is going to really help me out with some projects I have coming up around the shop, outside of the shop. We're we'll doing some fabrication work, and I just thought that would be extremely helpful. It's the main reason that I got that longer torch. My old torch works. I mean, it's beat up, <laughs> it's beat to death and everything, but it still works fine, right? Uh, I just wanted the longer torch for some jobs that are coming up. I think it'll be very handy. Um, my experience with WeldingStore.com was great. Non-affiliated, I paid full retail price. Uh, just speaking of my experience. So if you're looking for something like this, or you're thinking about making this upgrade on your own hypertherm torch, you know, there you go. It, it, it worked out well for me. So anyway, we have a lot of new products coming up. Uh, so please stick around. Thanks for visiting today. And as usual, be safe in the shop and I'll be back with you soon. Thank you.